the Golden Gate Park Tennis Center, soon to be the Lisa and Douglas Goldman Tennis Center, is a magical place. Golden Gate Park will turn 150 in 2020, and this tennis center has been around since 1894. And generations of people have played there. Parents have played there with their parents and their kids. San Francisco has launched some of this country's greatest players, including Helen Wills and Bill Johnston, Rosie Casals, Brad Gilbert, Peanut Louie, all developed their careers on these very courts. I started playing at Gungate Park at six, and my parents, they didn't have a lot of money to pay for lessons, so Golden Gate Park, that was our grounds for grooming our game. And I remember my mom putting us in the first Golden Gate Park tennis tournament and just started playing a lot of junior tournaments. And you know, my whole family, my sisters, we would play 10s, 12s, 14, 16, and, and do pretty well. Every other Sunday, they would just say, all the families, okay, we're going to just gonna have a potluck. And I think that's another neat part about my experience there was everyone came. You saw all types of nationalities, all types of background, and it's an even playing field. My best memory was the year I was number 19 in the world and I won Virginia Slims of Denver and had good wins over like Zena Garrison, Gabriella Sabatini. Playing on center court, losing to Steffi Graf, you know, it was uh, real quick, but you know, just knowing that I was on the court with a champion like that, even though you're getting pummeled, that's kind of a, a nice memory to be able to have done. Tennis is by far the best sport I can recommend for parents to put their kids in. You learn so much. You're out there by yourself. You got to figure the problem out. So tennis is just an ideal sport for all those life lessons. What we are planning will probably be one of the very best public tennis facilities anywhere in the country. 17 state-of-the-art courts, a sunken center court, lights so we can add over 20,000 hours of play, a dedicated pickleball court, and a beautiful new clubhouse. Any time that we increase the level of a facility in the community, make it more attractive, cleaner, more current, and looking towards the future, all of us benefit from that. At this tennis center will be a diverse array of public tennis players, ranging from seniors to competitive adults, to high school players, to summer camp kids, to what really is the heart and soul of this project, young kids using tennis as a way of learning life skills, our Tennis Learning Center program, where we are gonna have the opportunity to bring elementary school kids who have been through our programs in our neighborhood parks to Golden Gate Park for middle school. One, two, three, 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 three. school time program that serves students from K through fifth grade. We're serving the Bayview Hunters Point, the Fillmore area, Chinatown, and we basically serve students that are low income. The families usually have a hard time getting into after school programs, so our goal within TLC is to give them tutoring. They get one-on-one -on -one tutoring and also homework help. They are able to get free lunch and snack. We have one-on-ones with our parents. We're involved in the schools. Coming from the Bayview Hunters Point and growing up in that school system and not having the support we need, um, I feel like TLC is a huge impact because a lot of the staff that we have working in the TLC after school programs come from those neighborhoods. Seeing a program that served young people from like in communities that are traditionally underserved, though I'm not the most athletic person, and I'm not a mathematician, but um, I can bring the humanity and the relatedness to a, a struggling young person and talk to them from that experience. Well, what's touched me a lot is the tennis portion of our program because I was a basketball player, so uh, never in a million years would I have thought I would play tennis. And it's cool that you get to put academic and tennis in the same dynamic together. 
A lot of children coming from these communities feel very defeated, feel very powerless to their conditions. But having them know that, hey, there's something that you can be really good at, you can develop, and you're in charge of it. You can learn how to be a real good tennis player. You have the ability. We can, we can help you. We'll be patient with you. And you can learn how to read. You can catch up to the other students and surpass them even. For me, it's like just the love, the safety, the, the tolerance, but the empowerment. Being able to engage with them on the love of seeing them do better is why I show up every day. We're a couple of sets in, but this match isn't over yet. We need your help. Please join our community of donors and support this amazing project. Every dollar donated will be matched by an extremely generous gift of six and a half million dollars by Toby Philanthropies. When we have major community projects like this, we tend to do a challenge grant. People like the idea of having their dollars doubled. You put in one dollar and it has the impact of two dollars. Here's an opportunity for you to contribute to the welfare of the community, of having a first-class facility in one of the great parks of the world and a symbol of San Francisco. It had a beautiful tennis facility at one time, and these tennis courts fell into a very bad state of disrepair, and we're putting up money to help correct that situation. And what we're trying to do is make this a wonderful facility for the citizens of San Francisco. I think there's so many things out there in the world today that are trying to separate people. So that would be a really great thing about this center and being a place where families can get together again. No differences, rich or poor, beginner or advanced player, and just have a great place to put kids and keep them busy with something positive. I think it's a great jewel to happen in San Francisco providing tennis for youth, elderly, I couldn't think of anything better. <laughs>